Hello friends, welcome back to my channel, Tech Gitter Official. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix the issue of Bluetooth not being detected in Device Manager on Windows 11 or Windows 10. Now, many users face this common problem. Don't worry, I've got you covered. In this video, I'll guide you step by step through multiple proven solutions to help you bring back that missing Bluetooth functionality. So make sure to watch the video till the end and follow each step carefully. Let's begin. Press Window plus R. This will open the Run dialog box. Type in services.msc and hit Enter. This will open the Windows Services window. Now, scroll down slowly and look for a service called Bluetooth Support Service. Right-click on it and select Properties. Under the Startup type, change it from Manual to Automatic. Then click Apply and then OK to save the changes. To run the Bluetooth User Support Service, right-click on it and select Start. This service also helps your system manage Bluetooth connections properly. Once you've adjusted these settings, close the services window and return to your desktop. Check if the Bluetooth is now showing up or working. Click on the Start menu, then go to Settings. Navigate to Bluetooth and Devices from the left-hand panel. If the problem is still there, don't worry. Let's move to the next method. Now let's make sure your system is detecting the Bluetooth hardware properly. First, go to this PC on your desktop or in File Explorer. Right-click on it, and if you're using Windows 11, select Show More Options. Then click on Manage. This will open Computer Management. From the left sidebar, click on Device Manager. Now look carefully. If you see the Bluetooth section, expand it. Right-click on the Bluetooth adapter. It may be called something like Intel Wireless Bluetooth or Realtek Bluetooth Adapter. Select Scan for Hardware Changes. This helps your computer try to redetect the Bluetooth driver and reinstall it if needed. After scanning, return to your desktop and check if the Bluetooth option has reappeared. If it does, great. Go to the Bluetooth settings. You're almost done. Make sure that Bluetooth is turned on. Once it's turned on, try to connect to your device, whether it's a headset, a Bluetooth mouse, or your smartphone. If the device pairs successfully, then your issue is completely resolved. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more quick tutorials. Thanks for watching.